All right, here we are. It's the last day of uh, CES 2017, January 8, 2017, about noon. And here we are at the uh, LG Life's Good Lucky Gold Star, Korea number one. And it's the only place you can see any ATSC 3.0 over the air broadcast demonstration here. Uh, it's an F connector coming from a modulator underneath. And ATSC, God, it's been a long, long wait for this. They hope to have it finalized uh, at the NAB show coming in um, <laughs> April. Uh, <laughs> down there is Over the Top and Sling TV, and here's ATSC 3. Um, uh, ATSC 3, of course, uh, 1 is what's on the air at 19.39 megabytes per second. 1.5 or 2, that was the failed mobile handheld, uh, uh, sort of the AM stereo of television. Nobody watched it, uh, and it didn't didn't work in the marketplace. ATSC 3, we don't know who's going to launch it, but this is an example. Let's see what happens when we uh, change channels here. There's channel 11. This is a 4K signal on this ATSC 3 de demo. Uh, a Korean 4K. Can you see the uh, display? Alrighty. So there's 11.1 4K. 11.2. There's no content on anything but the 4K signal on one. And it's amazing that a 4K, of course, isn't a broadcast over the air channel. And in this demo, there's uh, several other channels. Two, three, four, five, which is audio only. Uh, six sports. I don't know. Yeah, that's UHD. That they, they don't call it PSIP, Program Service Information Protocol, in ATSC three, um, et cetera, et cetera. They do. They. It, it's an, an entirely new uh, stream. The the data rate on ATSC can be as high as 56 megabytes per second for a small coverage area, as low as. 724K for more forward error correction in a big coverage area from your terrestrial COFDM transmitter on ATSC3. Uh, it looks like they'll probably average out about 27 megabytes per second, a lot more bandwidth than uh, the current 19.39. And since it supports the new uh, HE high efficiency codecs, the same codecs that are on Netflix and things of that nature, uh, you can get 4K just like you can on any other service, over the air with an antenna. So we don't know what stations are going to start, which people are going to relinquish uh, ATS to, uh, ATSC 1 and go with 3, but somebody will, and it will be 4K. Come on, come on. There we go, a picture. Um, this television, it just says Super UH. I don't see a model number of it. They tell us here that it's going to be on sale uh, this April. Uh, in the United States, it'll probably sell. This is a 65 inch. Uh, it has dual tuners. It has one ATSC 1 tuner and an entirely separate ATSC 3 tuner. And I don't see anyone from LG here uh, to confirm or deny any of that, but that's the story. And I guess that wraps it up for ATSC 3. Here on the last day, the last moments, the last hours of CES 2017.